ranges, go for one. Rock, verify range, go. This is the rock, range green. Copy. Good news, the range is go, no technical issues. Less than two minutes to watch. Associated Press for Mr. Koenigsman. Um, this is your third attempt to land. I mean, what are, is there anything different about this third try? And do you see your odds as being better to achieve this since you've got the other two behind you? Yeah, so um, on, if you recall on the first one, we, we um, ran out of uh, control of the RT on the, on the fins, flew it basically. We fixed that um, on the second one. On the second one, we didn't have a drone ship there. <laughs> um, so the weather was terrible on the second attempt, and uh, and it looks it looks right now like the weather is significantly better. Um, four to six feet of swell is, uh, is nothing. We did uh, we did also upgrade um, the drone ship so it can um, keep the position um, better. Um, so we are more uh, we, we we can tolerate a higher wind and swell level than than previously. Um, and I guess together the improvements on the vehicle on the first stage and the improvements on the uh, on the drone ship itself, um, I would up my probability to seventy five percent at this point in time, maybe eighty. <laughs> <laughs> At T minus three seconds, the engine control remains. The engine ignition sequence to start. T minus twenty. T minus fifteen. T minus ten. Five, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You can say that being this close is quite a thrill and that's something we want to share with our veterans. This is a once in a lifetime experience out here. You're going to get goosebumps, the hair on your arms are going to, on your head are going to stick straight out of the air when you watch this. It's something beyond description. You've got to be out here and experience it and that's what we want you to do. Get out here, help these guys out, make a donation. So please.